What is up everybody, Hoosier Pulls here today. Thank you so much for joining me on my channel. We are ripping not one, not two, but three top series two hanger boxes from 2022. Let's get right into this with the odds. A little bit better odds than series one. You got one in four boxes for the gold. We are on the hunt for the Julio Rodriguez, Bobby Witt Jr. and Spencer Torkelson. Series 2 short print rookie cards. Also, if you're unfamiliar with Series 2, some other names that you're looking for is O'Neal Cruz, as well as Juan Yepes from the Cardinals. Thank you so much for joining me today. I really appreciate it. If you enjoy my content, please consider liking and subscribing. I do have a few giveaway videos going on right now. The links will be in the description, so you can check those out. All right, we're going to go through the base really quick. There's my man, Alfonso Rivas. Uh, we'll put aside any uh, O'Neill Cruz or Juan Yepes rookies, but the base, it's there's a lot of it in the hanger boxes, and you know I know you guys are just you know, you're wanting to see what's in the middle. You know, hopefully we can get some short prints, maybe some golds. An autograph would be sweet. I have not hit an autograph from Series Two yet. Series One was pretty good to me, and so far I have not had. Very much success. Here's uh, Striker Briggs. Here's his favorite player. We have Drew Rasmussen. All right, and we're getting to the middle here. Have a few more cards. We went quite a while without any rookies. All right, so here we go. We have Pat Valaika. And here's a nice Topps Chrome. Shohei Otani with a gold Roman Quinn. This is a really nice card. I love the chrome. We'll put Shohei up there. Unfortunately, the Angels just cannot win. Mike Trout is out as well. So we have Roman Quinn in the like bronze parallel, I would say. It doesn't really look gold. It was it's like a really like brown, kind of muddy color. So Unfortunately, um, you know, the gold in Series 2 has not been super great. Here we have a Salvador Perez 87 card that's pretty nice and a Generation Now Jack Flaherty. All right, we're going to breeze through the rest of these, see if we can hit an O'Neill Cruz or Juan Yepes. The big cards that we're looking for, like I said at the beginning, are going to be the Bobby Witt Jr., Julio Rodriguez and Spencer Torkelson short print rookie cards. They are not on like the official base checklist. They are listed as short prints. So that's who we're looking for right now. All right, we are getting into box number two. Just like box number one, we will fly right through the base cards, get to the good stuff in the middle. Hangers are a pretty good deal if you are, you know, like specifically um, trying to build a set. You can build a set for pretty cheap. Um, well, these are upside down, of course. Because you do get a lot of cards. This was $10, um, so definitely not a bad deal. We have Lane Thomas. We have High Five Highway. That's kind of a cool card. Okay, so here we have a green parallel. Let's rip it right off. We have Fenway Park Fireworks featuring the New York Yankees. So that is pretty cool. Check this out. We'll go ahead and put it in the top loader. All right, Fenway Park Fireworks out of $4.99. We have Judge and Giancarlo Stanton. So that's a stand worthy card. So not bad. We got a gold and then a green parallel. We have a nice. Oh, wow, look at this. Juan Yepes out of 2021. So we had a green parallel and then a Juan Yepes. All righty, so here's that Byron Buxton. So Juan Yepes, this looks like a really crisp card out of 2022. All right, we're going to move Shohei just off to the side. This is definitely the best hit of the box, but... We've gotten three numbered cards out of two hangers, so I think we are doing pretty well for ourselves. Here's the stars of the MLB. 
We have Mr. Wade Boggs. That's a really cool card in the 87. This is awesome. We got Jackie Robinson in the diamond die cut. So that's pretty cool. All right, we're gonna go through the rest of this. Let's see if we can hit an O'Neill Cruz. That would be sweet, but I feel like we have done. Here's Juan Yepes base. We'll set that to the side and sleeve him up later. So this was a Juan Yepes box. So nothing in the rest of that one. Let's get to the very last one. If you're still here, I want to thank you so much for watching. Please hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. I really appreciate it. I really love making videos. Um, this is like such a fun hobby for me. You know, just opening cards and collecting is, is so awesome. But also I found out that just like making videos, editing videos is something that I love to do. So the whole process from beginning to end, you know, filming, editing, it's all so much fun for me. So I really appreciate you guys for watching. It means the world to me. Uh-oh. Something looks like it looks like a uh looks like we got a little color back there. Maybe some stars and stripes. Looks like a candy cane, so that means we might have an Independence Day parallel, which I have never pulled in my whole entire life. I believe it is numbered to 76, so we will go slow. All right, it is. We have a Alex Bregman home run challenge. Who do we got? We have Joan Adon. Wow. 43 out of 76. This has been an awesome rip. We're gonna sleeve this up super carefully. So rookie pitcher for the Washington Nationals. Look at this. Joan Adon, 49 out of 76. All right, we're, we're gonna have to put him up there. This has been awesome. This I have not gotten hits like this in a very long time. We got Miggy, Ozzy, Adelis Garcia. We got Willie Adamas. And we have a Bob Gibson. Pretty sure Hall of Famer for the Cardinals. So that's cool. All right, we're gonna run through the rest of this real quick just to see what else we got in here they always have a, a long run of you know these landscape cards all right so this is a nice kevin kiermeyer all fired up and victor carantini as the last card all right so this was definitely an eventful opening we have the fenway park fireworks green parallel out of 499 that is awesome we have this roman quinn to 2022 from the phillies we have the joan adon first time i've ever pulled an independence day parallel that is really cool and the fact that it's the nationals too pretty cool washington dc definitely the hit of the video is this juan yapez to 2022 it looks like he could be very good in the future so everyone thank you so much for watching i had an absolute blast this was so much fun again if you enjoy my videos please like and subscribe leave a comment on which card was your favorite and we're going to keep growing keep making videos and until next time we'll see you later